In this video, we will give a quick overview of the Inlet Automated Python Part, or app as we like to call them. The Inlet app includes everything necessary to create your inlet providing the ability to modify the geometry to your needs, including openings and lifting inserts. After the geometry is defined, we can then add all the required reinforcing through inputs in the palette. To begin, we will go to the palette and choose the library tab. The Inlet app can be found in the default Python parts folder. Double left click to select the Inlet. You can see the app tools open in the palette. This is where we can define the specifics of the Inlet. First we will look at the first tab labeled FDOT Inlet. Here you can define the overall geometry, including different thicknesses and ledge dimensions for the Inlet. An option to include reinforcement. You can also include lifters if you wish from your fixture library. After the geometry is defined, we can then add any openings in your inlet in the next tab labeled Holes. In this tab, you can add multiple openings if you wish, and even combine the openings to create non-normal shapes if necessary. In the next tab labeled Reinforcing, we can then define any reinforcing that you want to put in your inlet. In this tab, you can define bar size, spacing, and covers of the walls and slabs, and also specific covers around the opening. Once you place your app in the model, you can simply double click to get back into the properties and make any necessary changes. If for some reason you need to make further changes to your inlet, you can always get your part as close to what you need and then turn it into a 3D element by unchecking the Create Python Part checkbox in the main page FDOT Inlet. After that, you can make any necessary adjustments needed. Have fun creating and reinforcing your inlet using the Intuitive Inlet app.